One of the most exciting features of the iOS 18.2 update is Apple's new AI image creation tool or Image Playground. And in this video, I'll show you how to get access to the Image Playground and all the awesome ways you can use it to create and save AI generated images on any iPhone 16 and iPhone 15 Pro or Pro Max. Before you can use the Image Playground, you'll need to make sure that your iPhone is updated to iOS 18.2. And after that, you'll also need to turn on Apple Intelligence. Then Image Playground app should be automatically installed on your iPhone. If you don't see it, then you can just install it from the App Store. Now let's go ahead and open the Playground app. You may need to request early access. And after a while after requesting it, you'll be able to start using Image Playground. Now we can hit continue and start. And as you can see, you can describe an image and add a suggestion from the list. For example, if I write a robot sparrow and hit send, you'll see it will take only a few seconds for Apple Intelligence to come up with AI generated image. And it will generate a quite few, which you can view by sliding left or right. And if you keep sliding right, it will go ahead and generate more images for you. Now, from the list of suggestions, you can tap on any of these and it will be added to the image creation bubble. And you can see it has added a scenery. You can go ahead and add multiple suggestions if you want. Besides suggestions, you can also type more inputs. For example, if I say a dinosaur and if I send it, it will be also added to the suggestion. And as you can see now, our sparrow is a hybrid dinosaur robot. Now you can go through the image generations, like or dislike it, and if you press the three dots menu, you can either share the image, copy it to the clipboard, or save it to your phone's gallery. If you hit done and go back, it will be saved to your image playground. Now let me show you how you can add a person and turn them into an AI generated image. And now to add a person, you need to tap on this icon. And if you don't see a person here, then you can also tap on the plus icon and take a photo or choose a person's photo from your gallery. And as you can see here, you can also choose between two styles, either the animation or illustration. Now similarly, you can add suggestions or input some more text to add into your AI generated image. You can also switch between the style freely, even after generating it. And if you want to delete a suggestion or prompt, then just tap on the photo to turn it into a bubble, and now delete the input by tapping on this minus icon. And after that, similarly, you can save and share it. And that's how you can create AI-generated images using Image Playground on your iPhone. If you found this useful, don't forget to hit that like button, follow us by subscribing, and I'll see you in the next one.